Watching the game was quite uh, emotional. Chiefs fans echo the same feeling after the team's gutsy win over Tennessee. Now Kansas City is Miami bound for the Super Bowl. I was more nervous watching the game than I was as a player. Leonard Griffin, a former defensive end for the Chiefs, has been waiting for the franchise to do something his teams weren't able to play in the big game. You learn to put it behind you. You know, so you don't dwell. Once that last zero roll up on that clock and you walk away, uh, you have a 24-hour rule. You learn that it's actually a business, and yes, you're there to have fun and enjoy, but your ultimate purpose is to win. In five of Griffin's eight years in Kansas City, the team advanced to the postseason. Before the NFL, the Lake Providence native was part of two championship teams at Grambling under the legendary Eddie Robinson. <laughs> well, first of all, he was a jokester. He always had that great story to lead into whatever it was that he was discussing. He, at the same time, was a father figure to many of us. Coach Rob was also there when Griffin suffered a neck injury that nearly ended his career. The first thing that he told me was that we're going to honor your scholarship, even though you're no longer going to play football. For a year, I accepted that, but then I wanted to play, so I begged, and finally he relented and allowed me to get back out there on the field and compete. That proved to be the right call. Griffin was selected in the third round by the Chiefs in the 1986 NFL Draft. He suited up in 103 games. He ended with 16 and a half career sacks. Now he's tackling the role of administrator at West Washita High School. Everybody asks me why I still work, because you want to have that impact. You want to have that relationship where you could steer guys in the right direction, give them some positive vibes to go on and be successful. Now as a fan, bringing a Lombardi trophy to Kansas City is special, but it'll never trump the graces given to him by the name that's on the AFC Championship trophy, Lamar Hunt. It means everything. You have that relationship to the organization that you want to see Clark Hunt and his family succeed. Even though I won't get a ring, I, I would love to see all of those players. Uh, and, you know, I, I would just be happy as a bug in a rug.